Textile and paper stocks uh, hold free as the Nifty trades above uh, 30 points. You're watching Market Movers, and I'm Ashul Dutt. Today we'll be joined by Srikant Sethi of uh, Motilal Oswal. We'll also be joined by Amar Singh, Head of Advisory at uh, Angel Broking for the technicals of the market. But uh, first, let's just take a look at what's happening with tire stocks. And let's start with the Nifty, if we can, Smita. And uh, we'll just put up the Nifty's chart. Uh, it was up around 30 points, holding up very well. And uh, actually, across the board, you have a, a significant strength. So I'll start with uh, Balakrishna. They do a lot of retreated tires. I think Balakrishna Industries, then we can look at uh, uh, JK Tires, Seat, Apollo, all of them up very strongly. So uh, there's significant gains there across the board. Also in some of the auto ancillaries, SRF and uh, Amtec Auto. And then uh, really housing finance companies all, all looking very good. Uh, one more stock is Aditya Birla Nuovo, if you have that stock, that's looking very strong. And then LIC Housing Finance, India Bulls Housing Finance. So that's the uh, thing that's building up on the large cap side. Uh, and then Star Paper Mills, JK Paper, uh, they used to, the Star has been actually very uh, strong technically anyway. Even we can look at Orient Paper. Uh, and then TVS Electronics, uh, we've been discussing that for one or two days, charts are very strong. And uh, TVS Electronics is uh, up on a freeze right now at 10%. Then Shiva Tech, a lot of textile companies, but uh, as you recollect from the past, these textile companies uh, have been uh, quite up and down. So, you know, uh, chart, chart wise, there's not much. VV Med, uh, also some of the Bombay based uh, real estate companies like Hubtown, uh, Jumeirah, but no chart patterns to talk about. Out of all these, TVS Electronics uh, is actually uh, the strongest if you're looking for any particular trend. Amar Singh is with us. Uh, Amar, thanks very much for joining us. If I may just start out with uh, uh, what do you see in the chart patterns, uh, just a day trade or more than that uh, uh, in terms of Balakrishna, JK tires, uh, Seat tires, Apollo tires? Yeah, looking at the overall uh, tire space, uh, definitely we've seen a, a, we are seeing a significant rally from the lows, almost up by more than 10% uh, JK tires currently around 122 level. So there is still some upside uh, that appears to be in JK tires. Technically, 125, 26 would be a level to watch out for. Uh, uh, talking about C8 uh, in particular, C8 we've seen from 1100 to almost 1270 currently, and uh, it's uh, it, it definitely looks uh, uh, positive. Uh, however, what's going to happen is that somewhere in the region of 1320, 1330 levels, uh, again we could see profit booking coming in uh, uh, C8 as well. And uh, talking about Bala Krishna. Uh, in particular, Balakrishna, we've seen a significant rally uh, today uh, from almost 930 to 995 levels. So uh, it it could definitely meet with some uh, uh, selling pressure at higher levels, close to uh, around, uh, if you look at the uh, technical level, that would be around 1,040, one, uh, 1,045. Uh, so uh, overall tire space, yes, there is positive movement, uh, but uh, these could be levels to actually book profits or maybe... Uh, look at uh, some uh, profit booking coming around these levels, slightly higher from here. Mm, uh, okay, Shrikant uh, Shetty is also with us. Shrikant, uh, good morning. Uh, I'm just wondering, uh, uh, tire stocks and auto ancillary stocks, should we not wait for the data for November for both cars and motorcycles, which comes out tomorrow at the latest day after, to okay. just see what kind of uh, impact, if any, uh, has there been on automobile and two-wheeler stocks? Yeah, I think see the immediate uh, what 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 we understand from uh, whatever uh, channel checks we have done uh, uh, from the auto companies uh, is that uh, there is a 